Okay, this is a tutorial on how to boot the computer from the DVD drive. I have a DVD inserted into the drive and I'm using the Asus E5K motherboard. Okay, and let's restart the computer. By default, Windows is starting and we have to set it from the BIOS to boot from the DVD drive. We just have to change the order in which the drives are being loaded and to, to enter the BIOS press delete on the keyboard now press it entering setup ok and using the arrow keys on the keyboard let's go to the boot menu and the first option is boot device priority boot device priority press enter and set the DVD drive to be the first one so the first device is the IDE drive DVD so that's correct so it will boot from the DVD drive and if it was the hard drive then it would have looked like this so the first was the hard drive and the second the DVD and in this case it uh, would have booted from the hard drive so let's put the first the DVD DVD RAM ok press F10 on the keyboard to save changes save configuration and exit press enter ok and since the drive has a DVD in it the LED will light up and the computer will start from the DVD and it's working press any key to boot from DVD and the computer starts from that disk and it's reading and the Windows Windows 7 setup is starting because it's a Windows 7 disk inserted ok that's it how to boot from a DVD drive using the Asus P5K motherboard ok that's it thank you bye bye